Welcome to our 12 gifts of the holiday season, or as we like to call it, tech myths. 12 tech gifts of the holidays with Tim Manfro. Thanks so much for being here today, Tim. Hey, thanks for having me. We're so excited. This is our favorite event of the year. Oh, don't 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 say that to all the other events, you know. Yeah. <laughs> um, Besides Revive. It's Revive's fun. our first favorite. This is number no. It's no, fun. this is our favorite one. We love this. Yeah, this is uh, something I look forward to every year. And I was talking with Mark, and I, I don't even remember how many years I've been doing this. I mean, it's got to be like, shoot, like five or six or maybe even more. I don't even know. But, uh, you know, my name's Tim Manfro, a.k.a. Mortgage Manfro. I work with New American Funding um, in Glendora as a loan officer. Uh, I love doing home loans, but one thing that I also love, maybe even more, is uh, technology. So um, I'm constantly researching new gadgets and items and and looking into new new things that are coming out, and uh, you know, it's it's something that just uh, I spent a lot of time on, and I was asked to provide a list of uh, the top tech gifts, you know, however many years ago, and created a presentation for Cvar. I think it was like one of the first presentations I ever did, but it was an easy one because I enjoy this stuff so much, and it's a really exciting time to share this, you know, these these items and these tech gifts with you guys. So uh, I put together the twelve days of techness. So we're gonna jump right into it. <clears throat> and uh, we're going to be sharing some videos and stuff throughout. So it could, the, the presentation could come down and you'll see the video pop up, but we'll, we'll work together on it. So, um, so we got 14 days till Christmas. So, um, you know, this year has been super crazy and I hope that everyone's, you know, safe and healthy and their families are uh, happy. Um, you know, but Christmas is sneaking up on, you know, to us and we have 14 days left till Christmas. So there is still some time to get some of these gifts if you guys move quickly. So, and I could always provide a copy of the presentation or T-Bar will. Um, and you could also search the, you know, any of the names of the products and you'll be able to find them to, to purchase them if you like them. So, so what do you get the realtor that has everything, right? I mean, this is like the common thing. Like my family always says it's about me. Like, you know, what do you get the guy that has everything? So these are some cool little gifts and I try and like mix it up with, uh, you know, um, uh, stuff that's expensive, but, uh, you know, mostly try to keep the stuff in the more affordable or lower range, but it is tough when you're going into tech stuff because there's just so much cool stuff out there. So, uh, so on the first day of tech, miss, you're going to get a little singing from me here, but, uh, so this is something that's really cool that I, I saw and I really enjoyed, uh, and I think would be kind of neat, especially with all the social distancing and things that's going on with family you know, and all, all that stuff. This is called the long distance friendship frame. Okay. So this is a, this is an item and, and they actually have lamps also. So basically what happens is you're going to uh, purchase a frame. They are $99. So they're kind of expensive, but they do sync together. So what happens is you can put any picture in there that you like and share it with uh, you know, a friend or a family member. It hooks up to Wi-Fi. And then anytime that you actually touch the frame, it'll light up on their end and on your end also. And you can pick the color of the actual, uh, you know, the, the, that lights up on the frame. So it's something that could just let people know that you're thinking about them. It can be killer for like a family member or even friends that, you know, are long distance where you can't see right now due to all that's going on. So um, only thing is, this is like the only thing on the list. It is back order. So you pr I didn't realize that until I started putting this together, but I thought it was so cool. I would share with you guys anyways. I think it's not available till January. So this is gonna miss the Christmas rush, but this could be something that would be cool for a uh, future gift for you know friends and family. So on the second day of tech miss. Um, okay, so this is called the revolution toaster. So I don't know about you guys, but I always oops, of course, clicked out of it. I always burn my toast. So this is a toaster that's going to take that away from happening. And basically it is, has a hefty price tag. It looks really cool sitting on your uh, actual counter, but I kind of wanted to show you guys um, how it works. So I'm going to pull up a video, so bear with me. You never settle for rotary phones again. So why settle for toasters that are just as obsolete? Welcome to the revolution in heating technology. It's called the R180, the world's first high-speed smart toaster from Revolution Cooking. It heats up and toasts faster than conventional toasters, offers precise, consistent browning, and locks in the moisture and flavor of more than just bread. The best thing since sliced bread now toasts it. The R180 from Revolution Cooking. All right, so 
basically that's something cool that you could get for someone. I mean, everyone likes to have toast in the morning, those uh, Pop-Tarts, uh, waffles, and their settings for each ones. And I actually did look at all the reviews online. I don't own this personally, but the reviews were really uh, positive. So um, if you uh, are looking to spend a little bit more than normal on a toaster, this could be a cool thing for someone that really enjoys tech to, uh, you know, make sure that they're not burning their toast anymore. So, um, so that's something that's neat. Uh, on the third day of tech, miss, we got the, uh, now I always like to throw something in for, you know, the pets in your family because they deserve gifts too. And I know we have two Bengal cats, uh, Tanner and Chico, um, and they like to play with all kinds of stuff that even, you know, this might be kind of geared towards a dog, but our cats will play with this too. It's called the Wicked Bone. And it's a stimulating ex exercise for your pet. So this runs uh, $67. And basically, uh, it's available to purchase. If you don't like Amazon, let me show you guys a video right now. So the reason that I all work and no play leave your dog bored frustrated and anxious like kids your dog needs exercises and your company so what should you do when you know that you need to spend all day working hard and what's the best way to offer your dog the fun stimulating and exciting exercise that she needs well we have an easy and super exciting answer to these questions now meet wicked bone a bone-shaped interactive gaming device that performs like a truly smart, fun, and wonderfully wicked companion of your dog. It couldn't be more exciting, really. Wicked Bone is really easy to use. Just download the Wicked Bone app and connect via Bluetooth, and you can start playing with your dog. Move it with its virtual joystick. Wicked Bone feels just like any other video game. Wicked Bones nine preset motions. So as you guys can see, um, it's kind of becomes tech because you can kind of, you can control it with your phone, which I think is kind of cool. And I know our cats are psychos and they run around like crazy people. And uh, you know, it, it, you could kind of tailor make the the movement of the device, like to have fun with your dog running around the house, or just you can actually set it to actually run itself too. So. Um, at 67 bucks, it's kind of an expensive pet toy, but we all know that we spend a lot of money on our pets anyways, and it's kind of be fun, you know, to, to mess around with that. So I thought that was kind of a neat um, item for your pets. So on the fourth day of Techmas, okay, this is something, basically, uh, you know, with everything that's going on now, we're, we're more and more aware of, uh, you know, uh, cleaning and, and um, you know, making sure that everything is on the up and up in, in that regards. And this is a cool system called Lark. And basically it's a self-cleaning water filtration system. So um, right now they offer the actual water bottles. They come in 24 and 32 ounce um, uh, options. So that's the one you'll see there on the left side of the screen. And uh, they run uh, $78 for the bottle. So it's expensive. But what it does is it uses UV rays, UV light, to actually clean the inside of the water bottle every time you screw, you screw the cap back on. And I don't know if you guys have looked at anything. I mean, water bottle like cleanliness is huge. Like there are major, major bacteria situations happening. And even when you put them in the washer, like uh, dishwasher, it doesn't always clean all the way inside of them. I've used something called Bottle Bright. It's like a little tab that you drop in that cleans them. But this is something that just automatically cleans it each time. And there's tons of, uh, you know, videos I watched on it. You can check it out online. There's, And they're also coming out with this even cooler thing, which is not out yet. You can actually uh, purchase on Kickstarter for 88 bucks. And I think it's going to come out sometime next year. And it's a, it's a Lark um, water pitcher. So for anyone that likes to have their water in the house, Let's face it. Things aren't always what they appear to be. Yep, rotten. At Lark, we've become experts at identifying what's underneath the surface, because you don't always know what you're getting just by looking at. It's definitely sheep. Interns. Appearances really can be deceiving. If only there was an easy way to see the truth about what's in your water. Well, now there is. Please. Pending science classes. We've finally invented a way to see the truth about everyday objects. Like this picture. 
Who are you? These specially tuned science glasses enable you to see contaminants in your water. Traditional water pitchers make your water taste better, but these filters actually trap and collect pollutants, making the filter itself a source of contamination. Yikes. Let's take a look. After only two weeks, your traditional filter starts to recontaminate your water, since it's become a perfect breeding ground for bacteria, mold, and other pollutants. That's why we invented the Lark Pitcher, featuring a two-step filtration and purification system. Everyone does the first step, but not all first steps are equal. The Lark filter removes lead, chlorine, mercury, VO, plus 50% longer than a plant-based carbon material combined with a complete redesign of the filter housing. We use 75% less plastic than ordinary better for the planet. Why is there a sheep in the living room? Indeed. A uh, filter's a good start, but for consistently clean water, you need that vital second step. The Lark Pitcher goes beyond filtration by purifying your water through our patented PureViz UVC LED technology. So say goodbye to bacteria, viruses, and mold. Not sure when to replace your filter. So as you can see, uh, it's kind of a cool setup there where basically you're double filtering your water. So any kind of contaminants that's housed in the filter, if it did, and it says like you have to start tapping after two weeks of not changing your filter. We all know anyone that's had one of those uh, pitchers in your thing, it doesn't get changed every two weeks, let's be real. Um, but basically this is gonna filter your water twice and the, the bottle actually, which I don't have a video on, but it actually has a cap that screws on and there's a UV light in that. And when you screw it on, it actually shines in the bottle and kills anything that's in there when it's empty, um, which sanitizes it. So it's kind of a cool, cool little thing there. Um, on the fifth day of Technus, we got the uh, Fitbit Aria Air. Um, and uh, my wife actually helped me research some of this stuff. This is one of the things that she found that I thought was super cool. So I know a lot of people, including myself, uh, you know, gained the COVID-20, you know, from just being locked up at home and, and all that stuff. And now people are really kind of, we've been uh, on lockdown so long that everyone's now starting to get into working out and trying to lose weight and, and getting fit. And uh, I thought that this is a really cool, um, you know, scale for $49 is a good price point. So a lot of people that use the Fitbit for tracking their fitness, um, this scale, and I know there is other ones out there that are similar, probably sync up with different uh, types of systems, but this one specifically will link up with your actual Fitbit um, uh, dashboard and it'll actually track your, uh, you know, your, your body index and uh, your, your total fat and percentage and different weight loss and different things like that. So here's a quick video on that for you guys. Fitbit Aria Wi-Fi Smart Scale measures more than just weight. It captures your body mass index, lean mass, and body fat percentage. And syncs wirelessly to your Fitbit dashboard, where interactive charts and graphs show your progress to help you stay on track. Body composition metrics show when you're building muscle and burning fat. Log food and exercise and get real-time calorie coaching to see how your choices add up to results. For even more motivation, add a Fitbit tracker and see your activity trends. Aria recognizes up to eight users and keeps your data private. Whether you're looking to lose weight, gain muscle, or start a new fitness journey, Fitbit Aria is a smarter scale for better results. So as you guys can see there, it's a pretty cool little setup how uh, it tracks everything and basically just the next level scale. And I thought the price point was pretty good too. So if you know someone that uses a Fitbit or if they have a different fitness device, I'm sure you could find something for that. But uh, they do sell them at Target, they're online everywhere. Um, so kind of something that, uh, Oops. Fitbit Aria Wi-Fi Smart Scale. So good, we played it twice. Uh, on the sixth day of Tech Miss. So this is super high price point, okay? So um, I think last year I actually showed the Mirror workout system, which was the thing that had the you know built-in like uh, workouts on a mirror that hangs on the wall. And this is kind of like the next level thing. And this kind of goes in line with the same thing. Like everyone's trying to get in shape now. All the gyms are closed. You can't go, you know, and uh, weights are hard to come by, all the different gym equipment. Now, this thing is called the Tonal, and it's the smartest home gym. And basically, again, the price point's hefty. So it's like 
three grand. So you'd really have to look at how much you pay for the gym per month and how many years is that gonna go for? Are you gonna lose this thing? But it's compact, which is kind of a pain with all the gym equipment, um, you know, being all over your garage or in your house. It hangs on the wall and there's a whole system that basically you use. I'm gonna show you a quick video on how it works. Whoops. Meet Tonal, the smartest home gym that learns as you get stronger with personalized expert coaching and revolutionary digital work so you can be your strongest. Okay, so basically, um, the entire uh, unit actually goes back into the wall. So it's just a hanging mirror that actually shows there. So that's, I thought that was kind of cool. So we might already be going backwards here in time a little bit. Technology. All right, so should be the Fitbit. I'm going to see the tonal. All right, we already seen this one here. All right, so if you got a big budget to spend on someone, uh, or, you know, as a family gift too, it would be cool just if uh, you guys all enjoy it. It appears that it comes with like a whole set of like weights and or, uh, the bar and the different rollers and bench and stuff and everything kind of is a digital weight. So the actual weight's adjusted, uh, you know, depending on what you set it on and you can go through the different trainings and stuff and, and uh, workouts. So it's kind of cool. So on the seventh day of tech, miss. So AirPods Max, uh, ultimate personal listening experience. Okay, so there's no way I could have tested these yet, um, but I know there's been so much hype about uh, Apple coming out with an actual over-the-ear headphone. Uh, I'm a huge AirPods fan. Uh, you know, I know there's a lot of different options out there. Uh, everything I use is Apple, so it all syncs up like really awesome. So I'm super excited about these headphones and uh, they do come at a hefty price point again, just like everything Apple. Uh, but they look super cool. And if you want to check this video out here. AirPods have come to define magical wireless audio. To build on this, we set out to create the ultimate personal listening experience. Introducing AirPods Max. Every aspect has been designed for uncompromising fit and performance. Machined aluminum ear cups connect by a unique suspension system, enabling independent articulation to the telescoping arms of the headband. This flexes to fit a wide range of head sizes with a warp knit canopy, maximizing comfort and breathability, while an acoustically optimized knit seamlessly surrounds the magnetically attached cushions. These components work in harmony to maintain an exceptional over-ear seal, the foundation for its incredible sound. Custom drivers deliver high fidelity playback with ultra low distortion across the entire audible range. And a pair of Apple designed H1 chips allow computational audio features like adaptive EQ, which tailors sound to your bespoke fit by measuring and then adjusting what you're hearing up to 200 times per second. Active noise cancellation uses eight microphones positioned to sense and block noise from any direction. A single button press activates transparency mode, letting you hear what's around you. And spatial audio, which utilizes accelerometers and gyroscopes to track head movement for immersive theater-like sound. And the digital crown allows precise control of volume and playback. With up to 20 hours of listening time, best-in-class active noise cancellation, and magical experience. AirPods. So, as you see there, as always, Apple products are uh, looking pretty sweet. So, we'll have to see. I do have, you have a nice pair of headphones, so it might be a stretch for me to, to uh, purchase these, but I don't know. It's tempting. It is a high price point, but I love Apple stuff, and they just look so cool. So, um, if you got an Apple fan, 
That would be a killer gift. Uh, they are on sale on the website currently, I believe. So uh, check them out. And if you guys have any feedback later, be sure to reach out to me and let me know. On the eighth day of Tech Miss. So Oculus Quest 2 VR headset. So this is something that uh, was up at uh, my buddy's cabin and his sons were had got, a, got one from their uncle or something like that and they had a couple of them. And these things are super cool. So VR has been around for a while. And, uh, you know, basically it seems like it's just getting better and better and better. So basically what happens is you put the virtual headset on and you have the little hand, uh, you know, remote controls and you, you're put into a virtual world. I mean, it's crazy. So I'm going to show you guys a video. And at the price point of $299, it's up there. But for the technology you're getting, it's it's basically insane. And you're, you're, you're more or less going to be playing like kind of a virtual world video game. So check this out here. Okay. Let's see what you got, Oculus. Someone, please help. Of course. I'll give you that. Okay, okay. Where are you? Come in. Yes. Yeah. It's on. Woo. Let's go. So those are actual screenshots from the the actual games so it just looks like it's super real you know and for 299 if you have someone that's into this kind of thing it's, it's an obtainable price and definitely i think it's worth for what you're getting you know um so check that out so on the ninth day of tech miss we got the uh, nebula mars 2 pro okay so Everything's changed. You know, we're doing things differently. We're staying home more, doing more things at home, or doing more things in the outdoors. And uh, I, I, felt, I featured a while back um, something from the same company. It was like a smaller mini projector. I know my friend Daniel Fontes bought it and really enjoyed it. But this is like the full size, big bad boy one. Um, there's all kinds of different levels. The price points go from a, you know low 200s, and you can go all the way up to this 549 as the price of this one. And then it actually goes even way higher if you want to go like super crazy, uh, you know, 4K or whatever. This is 720i or P uh, resolution, which is pretty good. And it's pretty wide. I actually have seen one of these being used. I have a smaller one, a different one than this. But uh, it's, fully it's fully chargeable, so you can take it anywhere. And has autofocus and uh, basically will create something up to 100 inches on the screen. So you can do it outside, inside. But it's great for like family stuff or taking camping or whatever, you know, and this is like a cool little video that'll show you a little bit more about it here. As you can see, so okay, so four hour playtime, so you would easily be able to uh, watch an entire movie or more. And the way it works, it has its own in infrastructure, like through the app or whatever. And you can you can download all of your, uh, or you basically can use like Netflix and different things, or or play videos on your phone and then uh, project it up through the actual device. So it's pretty easy to use and a pretty cool little thing. So if uh, you're looking for something to do, gift for the family or gift for someone that maybe goes camping or is outdoors a lot that might use this. Uh, this would be fun for movie nights and once it warms up a little bit, even though it's not that cold now, but uh, that's a pretty cool one. So on the 10th day of tech, miss. Hey, Tim, before you move Yo. on. Yeah. The question in the chat wants to know if you can connect it with game consoles. Uh, I, well, there's an HDMI connection, so I, I, yeah. I don't know for sure, but there is a spot where you can basically plug an HDMI into it. So I would assume, yeah, you could, you could plug a game console into it, but I'd look yeah. into it before you purchase for sure. But I know there is a HDMI on it, so I wouldn't see why that wouldn't work, you know? So 
Awesome. Thank you. Yep. No problem. All right. So again, in these crazy times that's going on, everyone's looking for more healthy alternatives, you know, uh, just looking at everything a little bit deeper than they did before. Right. So this is something that we stumbled across uh, as a family. It's called Air Moji. And basically it's style mess free fragrance, which is an interesting way to put it. But what these things are is uh, it, it actually creates the fragrance for your whole entire home. Okay. And they're little units that you can use. They're chargeable or they can be plugged in. And uh, it actually will, there's a million different scents. And what happens is it's actually totally harmless to people's pets babies, things like that. Like if you're burning candles, uh, if you're using some of the other like air fresheners, like those can be actually pretty bad for you, uh, we'll come to find out. And uh, depending on which ones you use, but a lot of them are. And this is 100%, you know, uh, safe for everyone. So I know we have uh, animals in our house and I know a big thing that we saw when we started like looking into these things is how bad like uh, essential oils and some essential oils and different candles and fragrances are for, for animals. And then also like looking further into it to babies, like people might not necessarily know. So these are this really cool product um, called Air Moji. And there's a bunch of different ones you can actually uh, purchase. But uh, I know right now we have them all over our house and there's ones for cars. Uh, but basically the reason they made, you know, kind of tech is they are actually able to be controlled by an app that syncs up with all the different units in your house. And it's kind of cool. You can set them to go a certain amount of time or on and off a certain amount of hours. Uh, so I'll show you guys a little video on that. actually been giving these away as like some uh some closing gifts and i know a few uh realtors that have been using them for uh staging homes like open houses things like that because they are chargeable so you don't even have to have electricity to use them and uh basically they create like this really awesome sense if you guys want more information about those just hit me up um you have to buy them from like distributor or something but we got connections on that but uh they're just awesome so check those out when you get a chance and they're, they're not priced too, too high. So it's something you can get for someone uh, that may enjoy something like that. That's looking for like a healthier alternative to candles and scents. So on the 11th day of tech, miss. Okay, so this is something again, like this, as we're seeing like all these items, a lot of them kind of are leaning towards like sterilization, different like, you know, looking at these different ways to uh, be cleaner and safer and, and uh, you know, make sure that there's no germs or bad stuff hanging around. So this is actually a company called 59S and uh, it stands for like 59 seconds. So they sell all these different kinds of like UV ray sanitizers, which is like a big thing now. Like I went into uh, a place and tried a hat on the other day and I had to go to them and give it and then they had to sanitize the hat with this UV ray thing. And that got me thinking. So I started kind of looking into it. I'm going to show you a little video on this company itself. 59S is a unique and innovative company that harnesses the power of the sun to protect you and your loved ones from harmful bacteria and germs. You can sterilize in 59 seconds or less. Best sellers we have is our pacifier mini box. We allow the mother just to press a button to sterilize and destroy bacteria and germs. So say the bottle falls on the floor or a pacifier falls on the floor and Okay, you wash it off, but is it really clean? Probably not. You still haven't sterilized it. So you put it in our box, sterilize it, and it kills all the germs and bacteria. Our products are so easy to use, all you have to do is pull them out of the box and start sterilizing. You can use it 50 to 100 times, and then all you have to do is recharge it like you recharge your phone. Thanks to the advancement in technology through our 800 plus member professional team, we have engineered 
our products to destroy heat, cold, and drug-resistant germs and bacteria. There are no UVC-resistant germs. So by utilizing the power of the sun with our products, we destroy germs and bacteria at their core, their DNA. 59S is located in the heart of Xinjiang. We plan in 2019 to open anywhere between 500 and 1,000 so stores you worldwide. You'll it's also really be able cool. Like, just type that in and check it out. Um, they have tons of different stuff. Like, they have stuff that goes over bowls and sanitizes bowls. But, I mean, if you think about, like, I thought it was kind of, I mean, just having this bag or the foam sanitizing or your keys and all that different stuff that goes out or the wand that you could have to, to sterilize anything just by waving the, the light over it. But uh, also, too, the, I thought the baby bag was just brilliant. You know, you're putting, like, you just want to make sure everything's super clean. And you saw them put the, you know, the, the uh, stuffed animal, and then they have the bottle one. I mean, it's something that, like, for a new, you know, parent in these crazy times, this would be, like, a killer gift. And uh, I think those ones were even at the 200 price point, too. So check that. Check those out. They do sell them on Amazon. So it's something that you guys can pick up. And I did see that you could get them before Christmas on there. So uh something neat for that might kind of come out of nowhere and something you might not have thought about prior to all this craziness that's going on so um all right so we we'll did the pictures wrong like i said spoiled the surprise 12th day of christmas techmas uh the ring mailbox okay so like i don't know about you in our neighborhood we haven't fallen victim that i know of but there is a lot of like mail theft and if you don't have a locking mailbox like you know, you kind of know when your mail person is going to come, but that might be something that, uh, you know, be nice to be notified if your mailbox is open. So that way, when the mail person comes, you can go grab it out. Or if you know that maybe it shouldn't be being open, then you know that someone's trying to look in there and you can kind of go out there and see what's going on. You know, hopefully it's just the wind has knocked it open, but maybe someone's going in there trying to grab your mail out. And obviously there's a lot of personal information in there. So it uh, is basically, um, I'll do a little quick video, but you have to buy the actual unit and this little extender thing but the total price for everything is 49 dollars, so it's pretty affordable it just came out so i haven't even seen this before uh before i was kind of looking at this presentation but here's a video this video shows you how to install ring mailbox sensor the sensor sits inside your mailbox so it can detect when the mailbox is opened however if your mailbox is made of metal it can block the wireless signal that connects the sensor to your ring bridge so we included a special antenna that goes on the outside of the mailbox. The antenna is required if your mailbox is metal, but even if it isn't, you can still add the antenna to get extra range and let others know your mailbox is protected by ring. Okay, let's get to the fun part. First, remove the rear cover from your mailbox sensor. All right, so that is the final item, uh, the 12th day of Technus. Um, couple other uh, notable mentions ones I did one I didn't put on here was I thought was cool so the Apple TV a lot of people have those and uh, I love the remotes personally but some people don't because they don't have the actual physical buttons so if you search like if you have someone that you know that doesn't like the Apple remotes they actually do sell a remote now that has actual buttons it's not by Apple but it syncs completely up and it has all the actual physical buttons so that's something cool um, but basically uh, now we kind of open it up to for anyone to share their favorite tech gifts or any comments or questions. Uh, I don't know how to do all that, but I know someone behind the scenes is gonna. I got talk. you. Uh, I think my favorite's that um, portable projector. Yeah. I think that thing's pretty cool. Yeah, I mean, I even funny, oddly enough, I just got this. This is like a smaller version of it or whatever, but uh, that company's super cool and the quality's awesome. Like. I'm going to uh, going to be going camping this weekend and uh, I'm taking that out there to maybe watch some ski or snowboard videos inside of our trailer. So, but uh, yeah, it's, it's just a cool little thing to take out and they're chargeable. They last a long time. So yeah, definitely something to check out. And um, if you want to know in the chat, they asked if, um, how can we get a hold of you to get the air fresheners? Uh, just, just uh, I'll share my email on the next frame here. Uh, Tim at mortgagemanpro.com. You can just email me or my phone number is 909-837-8777. You can text me, so either way. Awesome. And if you want and to copy this presentation, I, I'll send it to uh, C-Bar or you can email me either way. Like, you know, I'm sure someone will be able to get it to you. So you can just, 
go through it and Google any of the, uh, obviously we'll have the videos, but you can search everything online. So yeah, if you can um, send me the, um, um, the presentation. A, yeah. Yeah. That'd be great. And then if anybody listening missed anything, you can always email me. I'm n oakley at cbar.net or Tim, which is Tim at mortgagemanfro.com. You can always email either one of us and we can send you a copy of the presentation today. And then also um, this session is being recorded. So you guys can go to cbar.live and watch a replay. It'll be posted by next week. Um, so that's cbar.live. Um, check back maybe Monday Saturday, I'll talk to Steve. Maybe he can hook us up and get it done sooner. Um, and we'll get that on uh, cvar.live for you. You can rewatch that. And then also, the um, you can always go to Facebook and like us on Facebook. And it's Citrus Valley Realtors on Facebook. And you can watch the replay there. Um, and Steve did just say, yes, he'll have it up by the end of the day. Yay, Steve. Oh, Steve, <laughs> coming through. So, um, Danielle, your, your bestie, Danielle said, um, you can use the projector for work presentation slideshows at open houses, listing presentations. Dang. Um, once we can get in person again, but good idea. Good idea. So, um, other than that, I don't see any other, oh, Mark wants us to check out the aura ring. Yeah, I was gonna hope he was gonna mention that. So, yeah, that sounds super cool. So, it's aura like uh, like old aura ring. Yeah, it's the um, yeah aura ring. O U R A ring. Okay, cool. That's what he said. So Very cool. cool. Well, I want to thank you guys for the opportunity to do this. I really do enjoy doing it every year. So, um, looking forward to next year. And uh, yeah, I just. I'm lucky to have the opportunity and I'm just hoping like everyone's families are safe and well and healthy and have a really great holiday. So. Awesome. Thank you so much, Tim. Uh, we love having you out for our 12 gifts of the holiday season, 12 tech gifts of the holiday season. Once again, if you want a copy of this, you can email me, Nancy Oakley at, or it's N Oakley at cbar.net, or you can email Tim, Tim at mortgagemanfro.com. You can always check this out on Facebook, Citrus Valley Realtors on Facebook, or our replay site, which is cbar.live. With that, I wish everyone a wonderful holiday season. Happy holidays. Happy Hanukkah. Merry Christmas to everybody. Happy New Year. Thanks, Tim, for always being out here. And thank you, everyone, for joining us today. If you have any questions, my name's Nancy Oakley, your Education Events Manager. Um, everyone have a great weekend. Thank you so much and stay safe. Thank you.